Hi, I'm just basically here. This Daniel Zoni. I'm just wanting to let you know that somehow I've, I found something very peculiar in the news, and it came in the inbox. Um, they chose two articles: one for Cameron and one for Jeremy Corbyn. The Cameron, David Cameron, one typically has been put as the top headline, and then the Jeremy Corbyn one at the bottom. The David Cameron one. Um, Let's close these ones because I, I, I recorded this video but I didn't turn on the, the, the mic. So I have to redo it all over again. Um, same same video. Uh, and it gives you the, the, the voice of um, for the bombing and for war and then there's one against war. And you can see the media have been talking a lot of crap about um, saying that about Hoff label or something was for the war. The bombing, where it is from the incorrect, so that just justifies the point of view. Then um, there's no comment section to the public. It's basically got a the church approach, where David Cameron is focused on as being more legit. Um, so there's no comments to the pub the public. Um, then as you go back there, you see the, the, the Jeremy Corbyn article, um, uh, where I put it, where is it, there, where is it, um, where it says, uh, um, then it's got comments, same video, and then they, they give comments to the uh, open to the public. Strangely, there's no comments there, but there's comment there. But most of the comments uh, seem to be posting saying that in favour of uh, David Cameron, just the way people are easily manipulated into war. Um, my my comment is kind of like pushed down. Because I basically said I find it peculiar that it was already going to have to subject to comments in public way. Where, 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 here's my comment on both articles David Cameron is a barbaric warmonger and accusing Corbyn as a terrorist sympathizer is just stupid and ignorant. He has no understanding what a country's objective is. He does not know and understand that Corbyn is more democratic than the school bully dictator known as David Cameron. Then you get sometime. Then you get the trolls that that, that, uh, that pop up around there. Uh, there's someone mentioning stuff around there. Anyway, I uh, just see how it just shows you how the, the the media is just like very biased. It's not. Um, writing articles and just stating the facts about the situation in an unbiased way it's kind of like a way of motivating the people uh, it's, it's, it's trying to motivate people to be for K. David Cameron, the pig fucker anyway, I've got to keep it short just so it doesn't take a long time to upload uh, stop recording